hey, Miss Tara, uh, unfortunately, uh, Christopher, he got sick. Uh, he's at home and I have Tristan as well. So what should I do now? Can I just go get a COVID test? He had those symptoms that you talked about. What, what, what do I need to do? Can I just bring him back if it's negative? After three days and symptom free with a COVID negative test, yes, we do need to receive that from your doctor. So that will be something that we can help you out with. If you have questions about that, give me a call. And then if you're deciding not to get the test, do remember that it is at least 10 days since the symptom onset um, and then fever free for 24 hours without fever reducing medication. Um, the sy symptoms have to significantly improve um, and then making sure that um, if you find that you are COVID positive, we can talk further about that. Yeah, so you know, Tristan, he has these allergies. Um, is there anything that I can do so that we're not sending him home because he gets the sniffles and whatnot? For sure. Chronic health conditions must have a doctor's note. We can work with your physician on that one and our health services will also be able to assist with that. Just call if you have questions. Okay, great. Uh, so if I get this right, he can go get a COVID test. Um, uh, 72 hours uh, coming back after 24 wow. hours without uh, any medication to reduce the fever. Is that accurate? That's correct. Okay. Symptom-free COVID negative test. Yeah, I don't know if Tristan's going to like having a swab, so he might have to wait 10 days. And I know the school's going to be working with us to make sure they have that education happening between the partner teachers. That's good. That's right. Lots of good information on our website about specific symptoms, what to expect to help you make decisions. And we're here for you to help with that as well. Yeah, so I heard another friend that they were, um, they actually had COVID and um, what's going to happen if a kid gets COVID on, on school? So they are going to quarantine and the close contacts as well. The CDC is specific about close contacts, also information that we have on our website. If we do need to get public health involved, we will. And all information is entirely confidential. We want our families to know that. I know at the end of the day, I can just give you a call and you'll help walk me through it. We will, definitely. We have lots of support. It's going to be okay. Yeah, I think that's the best part. So really appreciate you, Ms. Tara. Thank you. Anytime. Always here for everyone.